Hi, my name is Robin Wong. I'm a photographer based in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. In this video, I want to talk about this really useful gadget here. This is a memory card holder case by JJC. Let's do this. Before we dive in, here are some important disclaimers. I have no affiliation or connection to JJC. I purchased this memory card holder with my own money. Well, the reason I bought it was because I was really curious. When I was browsing on the Lazada, which was an online shopping platform in Malaysia, I came across this memory card holder and it was selling at a very low price. It was about 37 ringgit or 8 US dollars and at such a cheap price, this looks like a really good product. And even if I don't like it, it's not a big loss anyways. So I got this out of curiosity and I want to share what I like and dislike about this JJC memory card holder case. There are many things that I really like about this JJC's memory card case. I love the slim profile of this case. It is so thin, it's very easy for me to store anywhere in the camera bag without taking much space. It is so easy to carry around. I also love the rugged construction. JJC claimed that the material is made from aircraft grade aluminum. I don't even know what that means, but this is very light thanks to aluminum construction and it's very sturdy as well. There is no flex. I love that it is a hard case, which means that the memory cards stored inside here is fully protected as I carry them around. I also like how I'm taking out the slider. All I have to do is just push. It is a pop-up mechanism. And it's very smooth. And if I want to store it, I have to put it back here and I push it in again. It is very satisfying. There is a click here. Uh, it is definitely something that is so easy to use. Now, inside this slider tray here, it is very, very versatile as well. You have ample uh, storage area. It can fit four SD card size from the top of the tray. If you flip, flip the other side, you can fit 12 micro SD cards. That's a lot of cards you can store. Besides storing cards, JJC also put in some versatile tools. Now we have this flat head tool, which you can use for multiple purposes. The one that I can think of is to use this to screw the tripod mount, which can come in really handy. And of course, there is the micro SIM adapter tool. If you're using an older smartphone, you have a nano SIM card, you can use this micro uh, SIM card to, to adapt into the smartphone. Now flipping this over the other side, there are also other tools available. There is a ruler. Uh, this ruler will definitely come in handy if you need some quick measurements. And there is the SIM card removal tool. The pin here, if you're dealing with a lot of smartphones, that can come in really handy as well. I love that you can store four full-size SD cards, 12 micro SD cards, and there are many versatile tools all fitted into this very slim, tray <laughs> into this really, really compact size uh, memory card case holder. One thing I really like about the SD cards holding mechanism is the sliding in and out of the tray. Now, when you slide in the SD card like so, you don't exert any particularly excessive force on any part of the SD card. Now, this is important to preserve the longevity of the SD cards. Unlike the typical SD card holders where you have the foam and you have these uh, holes where you fit in the SD card, as you put in the SD card, if you want to take it out, you actually have to pull it from the top, which means that you're exerting more force at the top here and in time you will actually destroy the top part of the SD card. SD card is made of really cheap, really fragile plastic so if you keep pulling in and out from the case like so, you exert too much force at the top here, the top part of the SD card will definitely break. It is also very obvious that the JJC is copying the design from Small Rig's memory card case. Small Rig has released this, I think it's been out for two to three years. They have the same sliding mechanism for the SD card holding area, and then the, they have the same slim profile, and they both, it's almost they are made from the same material, but it's obvious that the Small Rig is smaller, it holds less, it has less tools compared to JJC. 
I've been using the Small Rigs memory card holder case for more than a year now. I like that it's very small, it's very compact, it's very rugged in construction. It's actually very similar to the JJC's version. Now, once you slide this out, of course, because it is smaller, it carries less. It carries three full-size SD cards. It carries two micro SD cards, one adapter for nano SIM to micro SIM. And of course, it also has the pin for the uh, SIM card removal tool here. So less tools, it carries less memory cards, but hey, it is also a lot slimmer, it's more compact, and it still has the same slider mechanism. It's still very, very rugged in construction. It is not difficult to see that JJC took inspiration from the small rigs memory card holder case. I think that's a very polite way of putting it. It seems like JJC just copied the design or plagiarized it altogether. And they, took the liberty to make some improvements. They added more slots. Now instead of three SD cards, you can carry four here in JJC's version. Instead of just two micro SD, you can carry 12. They make full use of both sides, which I think is a very good idea. And they added a few more tools as well. Well, the small rig carries less than the JJC's version. It only carries three SD cards and two micro SD card slots. It has less tools in this kit. But there are a few things I like about this small rig's version. Number one, it is a lot harder to take out the tray. You need to exert a lot more force to push from the end here then you can take it out. This can prevent accidental tray ejection, which can happen if you are not careful. And I like that there is a stop at the end here to prevent the tray from going out all the way. And the stop here is quite hard. You have to pull out really hard to take everything out. You can see the pin here that is uh, preventing the whole tray from coming off altogether. I like these small things which uh, Small Rig pays attention to uh, and obviously that's not the case for the JJC's version. All you need is a slight push here and the whole tray slides off completely. Now it's too easy to take out the tray and there is no stopping mechanism, no safety latch at the end here to catch the tray and prevent it from falling everything off altogether. I find that this shows the JJC is not like Small Rig. Small Rig is a little bit more thoughtful when it comes to practical application and um, real world use. They think about safety. Now, this just falls off just like that. Overall, I still really like this JJC's memory card holder case. I love the slim profile, I love the rugged build, I love that it can store a lot of cards in a very slim compartment. It utilizes both slides and it does come with a few very useful tools. I find myself using them from time to time. Now, all this for just about eight US dollars, I think it's a steal. It looks really, really good as well. If you don't like the branding of JJC here, all you have to do is just put a sticker on top of it. it can be your own branding, your photography brand, or your name on it uh, with your contact number in case you lose this memory card. That's all I have to share about this JJC memory card case holder. What is the current memory card holder case you are using? Please share that in the comments below. I would love to hear from you. If you found my sharing beneficial, please consider buying me a cup of coffee or you can contribute directly to my PayPal. Links in the description below on how you can do that. Any small contribution goes a long way and will definitely help me to share as much as I can on this channel. Until the next one, please go out and take more photographs. Bye-bye.